Hey, so Mormon 7 is going to give us great insight into Jesus' gift to all of us. Moroni is talking here. Mormon 7, 6 talks about the resurrection. He bringeth to pass the resurrection of the dead, so all can come and stand at the judgment seat. Oh, this is great! Yes, I am going to live again. When we die, it's not the end. He, uh, as it says in verse 5, in him is the sting of death swallowed up. Oh, good news, Jesus! Ah, death hath no victory. Sting of death is is swallowed up in Jesus. We are going to be resurrected and stand with God again. So there's a action. There's a therefore what? Verse 8. Therefore, repent and be baptized. Same thing. If you go read Acts chapter 2, the apostles are talking right after Jesus leaves and says, hey, there's going to be this resurrection. They say, men and brethren, what shall we do? Acts 2, repent and be baptized. Repent and be baptized. Why? Because we're going to be resurrected. So we're going to need to make some covenants with God so that when we get to stand in front of him, we're ready for that moment of severe inspection. And we can say, hey, I witnessed through my baptism and through my covenants that I was willing to mourn with those that mourn, comfort those that stand in need of comfort, be a disciple of Jesus.